Welcome back. I'm assuming you just watched the first in this series about how to play the major pentatonic across the neck. And this time we're going to learn to play it up the neck or vertically, whatever you want to call it, along the neck. It looks like this. Pretty easy, let me show it to you. This time, instead of starting with our second finger, we're going to start with the first finger on the fifth fret, which is an A note. Okay, the intervals are one, two, three, five, six. And repeat, one, two, three, five, six, one, two, three, five, six. Okay, first finger, fifth fret, bottom E string. Third finger, seventh fret, bottom E. This time we're gonna slide up to the ninth fret with the third finger. Okay, the next note, first finger, seventh fret, A string. Then third finger, ninth fret, A string. First finger, seventh fret, D string. So far we've got fret numbers starting on the bottom E, 5, 7, slide to 9, 7, 9, 7. So that same exact pattern where you go first finger, third, slide two frets, first finger, third, first, we're going to repeat from the seventh fret of the D string. First finger, third finger, ninth fret, slide up to eleventh fret, first finger, ninth fret, G string, third finger, eleventh fret, G string. Now, because of the relationship between the G and the B string being the oddball pair, we're on to our second finger on the tenth fret of the B string. Repeating from 7th fret D string, we've got 1st finger, 3rd finger, ninth fret, slide 11th fret, 1st finger, ninth fret, 11, okay, now we've got 2nd finger, 10th fret. There's different ways to finger this, uh, some people might use their 1st finger as usual, the important thing is the sound, not really your fingering. Different guitar players finger it differently. Let's see, what do I do? Yeah, I go second finger, and then I do sort of a stretch to get my third finger up to the 12th fret, and then slide to the 14th fret. I'm in the B string, first finger, 12th fret, top E string, and to continue to the end of the shape, third finger on the 14th fret of the E string. So the whole thing, if I say finger numbers, starting from fifth fret, bottom E string, one, three, slide, one, three, one, three, slide to 11th fret, one, three, two on the 10th fret. Little stretch, third finger, 12th fret, slide, first finger, third finger. Play the whole thing kind of fast, it's like this. After a while that becomes kind of second nature, you want to work with a metronome tick tock tick tock
When you do it backwards, which you do all the time, we're going to slide on the first finger going down, descending. Okay, let's start on the 14th fret of the top E with the third finger. First finger 12, third finger 14 B string, first finger 12th fret. Now you slide down with your first finger two frets or a whole step. And you end up on your second finger, 11th fret. It's the way I finger it. There's, you can try another way if this feels uncomfortable. Down to your first finger. Now you got to kind of extra stretch to get back onto your first finger, 9th fret G string, 3rd finger, 11th fret. D string, first finger, ninth fret, slide down to the seventh fret. And third finger, ninth fret, A string, seventh fret, first finger, third finger, ninth fret, E, seventh fret, slide down to the first, to the fifth fret. So descending is like this, slide, second finger, stretch, slide, third finger, second finger, third finger, first finger, third, first, slide. So after a while you can uh, go up and down, just pretty slippery. You can go all the way up to the 14, 15, 16, 17th fret to the high A root if you want to, but it's kind of extra. Going down. Of course, remember to move these around, play it in G. Play it in F, play it in C. Okay, that's the major pentatonic going along the neck. And again, it's the foundation for uh, improvising. It's the, uh, the bright sounding pentatonic. And next, I'm gonna take a look at the minor pentatonic, which will probably appeal to a lot of the guys out there. I remember when I was uh, a young git picker, I really enjoyed the, the minor pentatonic. It's got a uh, real bluesy, gritty sound to it. Okay, enjoy. I'll see you next time.